Okay, so this is a lamprey. So cool. Uh, Subphylum vertebrata. Uh, the cyclostomata. So this guy uh, does not have bones. It does have cartilage inside of it. And if we take a look, we'll start on its tail end because I want to point out this beautiful tail. And so look at the way the fin, okay, so here's the caudal fin. And actually, if I look, I have to look way in the back here. So let me move him this way. And let me zoom it in just a little bit so that you can really see this tail. All right, and it's a little tricky because since it's preserved, it is uh, a little hard. Uh, you see how it kind of folds back. All right, so see how the tail, the caudal fin, which is technically this fin right here, it wraps around the end of the vertebrae, like the vertebrae would come right along here and the tail caudal fin wraps around. So that's a diffy circle tail. Okay. Then we have the dorsal fin. That dorsal fin. Here's another little dorsal fin. Okay. And that helps stabilize this little guy as he's, uh, to keep him from rolling as he's swimming through the water. Now this particular fish, right, because indeed let's put him dorsal side up. Indeed, he is a fish, but uh, it is a parasitic fish. So this fish spends majority of his time attached to something else, a shark or other big fish. And if we take a look, I mean, look at those teeth. Let's focus in on that. That is crazy. All those kind of orange structures are teeth. And there's even teeth on the tongue. So there's going to suction onto a fish and it's going to eat the flesh of its host by kind of this rasping and grasping uh, type of movement. <laughs> so I always kind of find them creepy for that. All right, so if we go along the dorsal side, then we have to look carefully, and we're gonna look right here in the center, and I can see an opening. I might have to zoom in on that, and then focus. There it is. All right. So can you see this little nub right here? That's the opening. So this is the median nostril. Median nostril. Right behind the median nostril, see this light area right here? That is the pineal eye. That allows them to tell uh, light and dark. Okay. A little bit of day length going on with that pineal eye. Can you see it? So pineal eye and then median nostril. If I turn him to the side, do you see, so now, so here's his mouth, right? We can see that this area right here, which is also light in color, that's the eye. Okay, so the eye is reduced. It's a parasitic fish, so that's the eye. So I should have two of those. I have one on this side, and I roll him, there's the pineal, and I roll him, and I look over on this side. Right there, looks like he's got some gook in his eye, right? So that is his other eye. And then there, of course, is the mouth. Okay, so we're just looking at the external anatomy of this creature. And this, again, is the lamprey. They get much bigger than this. This is a small specimen.